at least one could say about 11 very significant inconsistencies or discrepancies on her statements. But how did we get here? This is another My View TV exclusive. Please remember to hit the notification bell, like, share and subscribe. I don't bring nobody forward in your future for me. Everything where you see up my natural talent. Let me tell you something. You see when you know what to please the audience with, it's simple me. Other people, open body in okay, open body in alright. So nobody never tell the rest of them say, yo, I'm not afraid of people. Me can't believe when you never really tell them. So I can just adjust this little matter here right now. Big up my real Rasta friend, them real world Rasta order. But only look at friends, the rest of us feel like, say, me free down, think again. Going on the days when usually trick people about to know a black hat man and people that run up and down and run from you. Remember, me never afraid of them time there, you know. So, no, what's I no afraid now? Me always come and me tell us you one person upon this. Her time, me afraid of. And it's my mother, she not even have to say, hold on, she never say nothing, I'm just a run, because I'm just afraid, so. But hold on, people believe in the God of them things there. Me fearful of God. Fear and fearful are two different things. You understand? But tell the little friends, the rest of them afraid of soap and water, say. Me, not afraid of them. You understand? Every day, look us, but come and jail back statement, my view. And big up Rasta, can Rasta this and Rasta that. So, man, you need to go be a little friends yourself. And he's off of this platform, yeah. Me, can I tell you something? Me and Uno, yes, none of we don't know. We really have to end on our head. Me, I'll be honest, people, we don't ever scissors got it. We don't ever pop it, pop out. My word against your word against your word against my word. Tip for that. That is all I go on right now. You understand? I mean, I really do my time up, people. Maybe I'm not sure class. You can take a little time and grow back. That is all I have to say. I'm a matter of fact, some holy people come out and say holy people things. I'm going to make a list to them right now. At least one could say about 11 very significant inconsistencies or discrepancies on her statement. Because you not only heard from the other detainees who were there, but you had accounts of her classmates where she indicated certain things that, to them. That she had cut her own hair. In fact, one of them, um, a fe female, indicated that she had spoken to Miss King, who had previously spoken of plans to cut her hair approximately one week prior to the incident. After the incident, she heard her say, What is not this? Look how me cut me hair and can't comb it. She placed herself in a taxi with other persons and being pepper sprayed by the police. This account was not only contradicted by the investigating officer, but also by one of her schoolmates who actually was passing by and saw her standing on the um, roadway. You had statements from other detainees in the lockups who observed her over the period of two days pulling... Days, more than one? Two, I guess. Yes. Pulling the locks from her head over the space of the two days. Pulling out her own house. That is so from her head, and two police officers, including the female police officer, were made aware of this, according to their statements, and they went to the cell occupied by Miss King and saw the locks on the ground. I'm not surprised by the ruling. The ruling from the DPP's office is evidential. It is evidentiary. Um, the investigation was by IPRO for months before it was handed over to Indicom. And given the tone of Indicom during the investigation where further questions, detailed questions were asked to elaborate about the first statement, not surprised when I'm hearing in the space about um, inconsistencies in a statement, which is, mat is a matter for the jury and no one else. So I'm, I'm not surprised. But notwithstanding, I have... Instructions, and thank God there is the civil realm. Nothing changes. Miss King maintains her statement. I want to inform everybody that I have locks 
and I would not be able to suicide myself with my lungs. And I would not be able to pull them one one. You know how painful it is? Mm-hmm. If you pull one, you cry for half an hour. So I am looking at the fact that there is a long story and there is especially a young Rastafarian. And I'm looking at the fact that all of that sounds very much as disrespect towards what it is the crown for a Rasta lady. I think uh, that is absolutely wrong because if it's so, it is a private business. It's not something that you put on the media so that everybody can know. Secondly, what is the reason why she is supposed to do own counseling for the trauma of this situation which has involved a 19 years old girl in a big story which has been changing completely her daily life as has been traumatizing her and probably this is the result of what what has been happening to princess in the last month Mm -hmm. so i don't think that should have been mentioned at all especially without explaining the reasons why jamaica this and that's a justice system but anyway we are standing by our stance we're not letting go you know we're just holding on and we're just working alongside with the liar and you know we really have not much to say right now but that's our stance we are not letting up. We're not letting go. The justice system, we know say no wrong. We know that. That two law. One be upper class and one be lower class. I like police people them and soldier people them. <coughs> we come and beat Rasta. The whole of them have Rasta in their family. No cure with them and go say if they ignore it. The whole of them. Because to my overstanding. The police woman who trimmed my daughter, I'm getting to understand, saying father was a Rasta man. And trim. And go to the police. So you want to tell me, say, you never teach him no culture about Rasta? No, man. After six months of investigation, that you come up and find no one criminally responsible, it's an insult to our integrity and to our intelligence. I think we should ask for the removal of the DPP from her office. I think the government through the cultural department or the Rastafari community a big, big, big apology. And I am asking Minister the Honorable Babsy Grange to do so. But importantly, to increase the applicable penalties for breaches of provisions of the act relating to prohibited weapons. As such, the bill introduces harsher penalties for offenses connected to the illicit trade, manufacture, stockpiling, possession and use of illegal guns, possession of illegal firearms. I think the term illegal may be inappropriate, but unregistered firearms. At this point, the surrender these firearms and ammunition to the state without prosecution for a short period before the full impact of the bill is initiated. As the government advances our trust to get every legal gun, it's our intention to provide citizens with an opportunity to surrender the unregistered guns as soon as this new bill is signed into law. Let us not rush it too much. Let us make sure it's done thoroughly, but do, do it with due expedition. So at the end of the day, when we enact this bill into law, it is a solid piece of legislation that will send the right signals to the country, especially to those who currently feel that they can get away with murder, shooting with impunity.